I'm continuing the story of the Batman Hell Hell version, episode 3. With Gotham on the brink of Bruce under and Bruce under fire, a new generation of supervillains rise to prominence and threaten to overturn the traditional institutions of power. Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises. You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents learned that the They're waiting for you in hell! Then it just felt light. Like I could do I like the previous I version. Can you... Can we give her no the drug bag? Also shot Penguin this guy in heart in the head. There are others whose families were destroyed but by yeah, Wayne. They'll make Gotham pay for his sins. But what would Harvey think? What, she, what is her scar? Working together. It disappeared. What the fuck? In, pre in previous... Are we alone? It's gone now. Move. We, uh, we, we should go. That's weird. Huh. They forgot to add it. The GCPD has orders to take you in. After tonight, I can't stand in their way anymore. So sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. Uh, we need a new moderator. You there? Yes! Yeah. Oh, Thank you for volunteering. My downtrodden brothers and sisters of Gotham, you have nothing to fear. We are the children of Arkham. Mr. Dent. <laughs> Thank you. Also, he got eye broken as a Batman. I think that both intact here. Interesting. They they didn't cut it from the original. They recreated it. Otherwise, I don't understand how it might have happened. Gotham is still reeling after last week's mayoral debate. With the drugging and subsequent murder of Mayor Hamilton Hill, Harvey Dent was left running unopposed. After a rather lackluster election, Bruce, finally, a friendly face. Visit, he's still being held for observation. Meanwhile, it's good to see you. How's your left eye? Nice outfit, Harv. That is. Quite the look. What? I'm mayor now. Thought I'd start a new trend. Really, though, I can't wait to get out of here. Gown included. Oh, what have you got there? I, uh, Are we romancing <laughs> I brought you with some Dent flowers. now because I just so chose I to save him first. instead of Catwoman? Yeah, well, my mother and my secretary. Uh, every gay boy's like, dream. Are you gay? One woman I thought would visit, or at least call, hasn't. Selena's been a no-show. I thought she'd at least come by to congratulate me, if nothing else. Guess we weren't as close as I thought. Maybe she just saw me being a coward. about it. Well, it's probably for the best to forget about her. Oh, I was kind of hoping you'd be a little more optimistic. <clears throat> Maybe you're right. 
I am glad you're here, though. God, it's been infuriating. Just sitting here and having nothing but time to think about what happened. I wish I could make myself turn it off completely. Watching footage of the debate over and over. Penguin would have just beaten me to death right there in front of everyone. He wanted to. I mean, if Batman hadn't been there, I would be... I was helpless, Bruce. Helpless. I couldn't do anything. Batman was the one who stepped up. I mean, he's the reason I'm sitting here. No one else even did a damn thing. Yeah, I can... I can still hear him laughing. What they did to Hill, to the moderator... I have to live with that. But you heard them up there. The penguin and that maniac <laughs> on screen. Oh, this isn't over. I need to stay sort ahead of them. Fast facial They're trying expression. to cause discord. That stun at the debate was just the first step. Batman stopped them from killing you the other night, but they will try again. I won't hide from them, Bruce. The tonight's speech, they'll know where I stand. Of course, the doctors aren't thrilled about me leaving. My therapist is worried the drug might have caused some issues to resurface. Uh, make them unmanageable. She wants me to take it easy. To go slow. I mean, that's impossible, right? I gotta be able to Take it easy? How am I supposed to do that? We all have demons, Harvey. Yeah. Isn't that the truth? Honestly, I'm fine. Besides, I know I'm not the only one dealing with the fallout from that debate. I know how much you loved your father, Bruce. I know that debate was hard on you, too. Harvey, don't. You should talk about it. Finding out your dad drugged Esther Cobblepot? Hill admitting to having both of them killed? It's a lot to process. I'm sorry. Just because I keep reliving it doesn't mean you want to. Well, I'm not even convinced that tape was real. It had to be fake. Doctor to look like something else. I hope you're right. It will take a lot to prove that to the public. <sighs> look, I, uh... I realize what a terrible friend I've been to you. I was so focused on the campaign. I, I thought distancing myself from you was the only option. I'm sorry. Oh, that fake quick drama. Thanks, Harvey. I appreciate that. I'll make it up to you. It's really appeared out of, out of nowhere. That, what is that? Oh, I have that to distance someone. myself for the sake of coming from near the GCPD. Politics. <laughs> That's one way to get the guy's attention. And look, I, I should get going. No, that's Art. the first time. What, already? Bad signal appears. What else do you have to do? My, my assistant won't be here for another hour. You can, you can stay if you want. I, uh, I have a date, actually. What? Why didn't you say so? Well, don't keep a lady waiting on my account. I do want to hear all about her later, though, all right? You keep your head up, Harvey. Thanks, Bruce. Like what they did with the title. Uh, Unit six in pursuit of suspects westbound on 15th Street. City background. Is it the bats. children of Arkham? Can you confirm? That's not bad. Negative. They're taking shots at us whenever we get close. Understood. Stay on them. We'll think of something. A little help would be nice. Hang in there, all right? Oh, they knew we'd be there, Jim. We don't have enough officers to deal with this. Look, everyone stretched thin. I'm doing what I can. I have to go. I saw the moon. It that doesn't have the sign. Has a bat on it, Jim. You give me a number to call, I'll rethink my methods. I'm just glad it got your attention. I didn't have a lot of options. So, here we are. It's pretty obvious. Says the man dressed like a giant bat. I'd rather have you arrested than come to you for help, but the truth is we're desperate. I'm calling a truce, just for tonight. We've Bring been at war? Right. 
We can talking nicely at one other my roof. The one who tried the to last episode. Me. I know, but hear me out. She's trying to clear her name after those animals manipulated her into killing Falcone. She's supposed to be on leave, but she got a tip on the children of Arkham's chemical stash. Went rogue. She's out there alone, and I can't spare anyone to back her up. I told her to wait, but this is personal. The children of Arkham are like full of junk. She went rogue, and you didn't try to stop her. I did what I could, all right? I'm asking for your help. These children of Arkham are everywhere all of a sudden. Where the hell they all come from? I never heard of them before. And a debate. Uh, Gotham oh, they're tearing up the entire city. Never mind how this began. We have to focus on ending it. If you've got any bright ideas how to do that, I'm all ears. Gordon, this is Schultz. Over. Gordon here. We got a problem with the mayor, sir. What happened? Is he okay? I don't know. We lost him. He took off and left us behind. What mayor? Christ, one more crisis I can't deal with right now. Didn't mayor was killed? We've got to keep both Montoya and Dent safe. Somehow. Oh, Dent is now mayor. I'm on it. You there? Always. Launch the drones. I need eyes on the city. Lucius has made some upgrades. I'll let him explain. Who are you talking to? You got a whole team or something? A little busy at the moment, Jim. Say no more. All right, patching you through to R&D in Wayne Enterprises. Batman, so listen. The first model was only equipped for visual surveillance. Oh, But seeing how you used them at the skyline, <laughs> I thought you'd need an audio feed as well. Uh, the microphones are incredibly sensitive. They can pick up sound from up to 500 yards. In some cases, you'll even be able to hear through walls. Like x-ray peering. Just what I needed. Thank you. Being one step ahead of Batman, it's kind of my job. Any idea where they might be? Montoya's car was spotted crossing the bridge to Arkham Island. Could be where the handoff is happening. What about Dent? I'm probably headed to his acceptance speech. They just left the hospital and we lost sight of him. What do you keep looking at? That car's been behind us since the hospital. Oh God, is this guy trying to drive us off the road? Just drive faster. What the? Oh, damn it! Barrels of this stuff to transfer. And not a big window to unload all of that. They said they wanted it done tonight. Is this a choice? So it's a choice be done. between. You want to argue with them? Harvey Dent and random just keep an cop? eye out for that cop. Nobody move. This is a police. Get her. Yeah, that's kind of a weird chase. I just want to pick a random cop just because it's probably The less popular one. Headed to the construction site. Send whatever men you can spare after Dent. Well, not probably, more certainly. I'll round up what officers I can. Gonna have to head out there myself, too. I know this is risky, Batman. Just be careful. Unit 6, requesting backup. Corner of 15th and Main. We got a major disturbance here. Several armed suspects on the loose. Place near Arkham Asylum, yep. I got this one. Batman, 
Look out! Please kill me. It's over. Drop the gun. Look, I promise I'm not going to shoot you, okay? I used to think you were a threat, but I was wrong. We both have much bigger problems right now. I'm sorry. Can you forgive me? Those guys had me pinned down. If you hadn't shown up when you did, I... You want forgiveness? Look somewhere else. I just want you to know, I've got your back, all right? I don't know what I was thinking, coming out here alone. I nearly blew it. I could be dead. Or you could be dead. And it'd be on me. You're lucky I was here to clean up the mess you made. This was reckless. You're one to talk. I don't need a lecture coming from you, Batman. I still don't understand how they knew I was coming. Heads up. The cops just sent three black and whites to stop our guys going after Dent. The chatter sounds like Gordon's with them. Someone's gotta help Gordon. They know he's coming. Go. I'll see what I can find here. I'm not giving up on this. Why does she know about all that? <laughs> Is she going to be a like important character now? Alfred. Are you alright? Yeah. But they knew I was coming. They seem to be getting info on the GCPD's whereabouts. Not sure how. I need an update on Harvey. Bringing it up now. Deborah, get down! <gasps> Mr. Dent, what did you do to him? I said get back in the car! There's more of them coming! Put down your weapon! There's too many of them! Take cover! You'd better get down there. On my way. Self-defense, he says. New mayor's pretty tough, turns out. Killed one of those guys attacking him with his bare hands. Dent did that? Guess the fella's lucky Dent got to him before you did, huh? You're right. I wouldn't have let him off that easy. Of course you wouldn't. You gotta scare them. That's the... that's the point. We got our asses handed to us. They knew you were coming. How? We've been using a secure channel. You saying we got a leak? Gordon, Gordon to, to command. command. Anyone, Anyone there? there? Command, command here. here. What is what it, Gordon? Gordon? Turn that off. What? It's been compromised. The children of Arkham are listening in on the GCPD's communications. I'm gonna look into this. I'll let you know what I find. I mean, it looks like a simple radio. Just gotta know the frequency. Unless it's encoded somehow. <sighs> GCPD's been compromised. The children of Arkham were listening the whole time. How? That's what I'm going to find out. Alfred, I'm sending over evidence of some kind of encrypted communication signal. It's coming up on my screen now, but I'm afraid it looks like a bunch of gibberish to me. I need to go to Wayne Tower and look into this. Get me Lucius on the line. Yes, right away. If the public finds out the police aren't able to communicate... <sighs> Uh, 
I'm not sure of anything right now, but Lucius will have answers. I have a feeling we've only seen the tip of the iceberg. Hopefully it doesn't sink us, sir. I have Lucius on the line now. Bruce, are you there? I'm looking at this data Alfred sent me. It's messy. I have to know what the children of Arkham are doing. How fast can you decrypt? That's a tough one, but I should have it cracked soon if you can meet me at Wayne Tower. Already on my way. Almost there, Lucius. I'll meet you down in the lab. Some aspects of the children of Arkham surveillance are worrying. Great. Bruce. Chairwoman. I didn't think you'd be here. I was, uh... I used to look to Thomas for guidance in hard times. Must seem silly. After everything that's happened. You know what they say about old habits. Yeah, I, uh, I miss them too. Both of them. I know. Every day, I wish a father was still with us. He was wise beyond his years. And Martha. She was such a delight to have around. I've been called in for an emergency board meeting. I wasn't told about it. You weren't invited, Bruce. You are the topic of discussion for the board. They want to decide what your future at this company will be. Whether to... dismiss you or not. You have to understand, Bruce. This company is bigger than any one individual. We have to keep face. And after this scandal... What? They can't fire me. It's possible they can. It's the most logical solution with the business in jeopardy. It doesn't mean I have to agree with it, though. Bruce, I've got something. You need to get down here. Now! I worked with your parents for years, and neither of them gave any indication of foul play. How could you have ever known? Bruce! You're nothing like him, Bruce. We always build up the people closest to us. When they fall, it's a terrible blow to everyone around them. I appreciate the sentiment, Regina. Thank you. I mean what I said before. Families like ours need to flock she together. She doesn't even open her mouth Perhaps now. Perhaps <laughs> now, more than ever. So bad. I should head down. Oh. I don't want them to make a decision without me. I'll come find you after. I don't even buy this I'll be right crap. Down, like, oh, we're going to fire you from your company. Like, It's never going to happen. Not even in a failed choice. That's not how chess work too, but I guess it's a for secret passage. Good to hear she's still in your corner. <laughs> Spying on my conversations again? Hey, I'm looking so out for you. He's walking, working for me. The board was going to take action against you. If you lose the company, that man will take a massive hit too. I know the cave is well equipped, but all of this is owned and paid for by the company. You can't afford to lose their resources. It doesn't matter what the board does. We'll be fine. I'm not going to let anything get in the way of what we're doing down here. Try saying that when you can't access this wing anymore. 
Right now, finding out how the children of Arkham are spying on the police is more important. What have you got? It's Wayne Tech, Bruce. As you know, Wayne Enterprises is a telecommunications giant. If someone were to, say, uh, build a back door into that tech... You're telling me the children of Arkham hacked into this system? So that's the thing. Do you want the good news or the bad news? Uh, you're not gonna like it. Well, no shortage of bad news lately. Might as well just pile more on. Well, you see this back door they're using. I built it. You? What are you talking about? When your mission as Batman started, you needed a way to monitor the city. Well, this is how. I piggyback Batman's surveillance onto Wayne Enterprise's signal. If the children of Arkham have access to the same system, does that mean they know my identity? It looks like they've only accessed the GCPD so far. Not a lot of activity otherwise. I'll have Alfred warn Gordon. The GCPD needs to get rid of their Wayne Tech devices. Smart move. <laughs> I've encrypted our access. I can fortify it, but it's gonna take longer to force them out of the system. The question remains, how did the children of Arkham find out about the back door in the first place? They shouldn't have been able to find it. Not unless they knew what they were looking for. Whoever broke in certainly knew how to cover their tracks. We have a mole. There's no way they could have gained access without someone on the inside. Only a handful of people at the highest level could possibly find out about the back door. I'm gonna keep working on this Children of Arkham business. See if there's a way to shut down their access entirely. We'd better lock this stuff down, just in case. Uh, Tiffany's really taking after you. And Luke, stubborn as always. I think of what Gotham has become, and I think of them. They give me all the reason I need to work with Batman. He's the only one that will truly protect them. And he will, Lucius. Uh, he doesn't Always. know what the identity of Batman? Thermal vision? You've been busy, haven't you, Lucius? Ooh, what's this? Uh, something I'm still working on. Some new armament to assist you in the field. There's only so much you can do on your own. No. They but just talk in really third yet. person about Batman. I always wonder why you had a table that could hide itself. I guess it's coming in pretty handy now. Trust me, it was much more paranoia than precaution. A new sticky bomb I developed. The signal is activated on the underside. Attach it wherever you need, then detonate it remotely with your gauntlet. Boom. Nice. Be careful, those things pack a serious punch. You know, stick it up my ass. Looks like another invaluable piece of Lucius Fox technology. <sighs> Looks like Regina's headed to my office. I should go. Now before you do... Here. Get that back to the Bat computer. It'll install the added security measures. You'll also have all the info I found on the children of Arkham's activity within the system. Thanks, Lucius. I've always got your back, Batman. Now get out of here. Regina doesn't like to be kept waiting.
pink piece. <laughs> Laid on the t on the floor. But now it's here on the chessboard? What's happening? Is there another set of chess pieces? Or it's just glitched out? Mr. Wayne, Ruth, open up. I thought maybe you left. Yeah, right. Now it's gone. Well, okay, it was a glitch. The board has voted. And have they sent the chairwoman to wield the axe? You're being asked to step down from your position as CEO. Effective immediately. At least until this whole mess gets cleaned up. I won't do it. Bruce. This is my company. My name. And that name is exactly why we're in this situation. This isn't a request, Bruce. I asked to slow all this down, but... The press release is going out as we speak. There will be a public event in the morning where you will formally announce your resignation. I'm sorry, Bruce. I tried to fight for you. The board believes this is the only logical course of action. I see where they're coming from. Well, you should have fought harder. The board would have listened to you. They'd already made up their minds. I did what I could. You have to trust me on that. Our stock is tanking. The board is losing confidence. Wayne Enterprises needs a new face. They already had a candidate in mind. I thought it was... <clears throat> I was outvoted. <laughs> Remember, he'd only be interim CEO. Just until this mess gets cleared up. And who would that be? Of course. Oswald. A Cumberland. random guy from the street. Oh, so boy. Good to see you again. I should have hugged him, actually. What a chilly Funny. greeting. As you know, Oswald's parents were, well, victims of your father's actions. This company was built on the land he stole from the Cobblepot family. Oh, well, the board thought having me step in would be a good PR move. What better way to show Gotham that Wayne Enterprises is committed to righting the wrongs of the past? Happy to help any way I can. People aren't much behind the Wayne name now. And considering that your parents stole Come from on, it's so silly. Cobblepot, so it's easier on the tongue. I don't need your help. I can fix this myself. Well, that's admirable, but your name is tarnished, Bruce. You need me. Unfortunately, he's right. Any move from you, no matter how genuine, would appear self-serving at this point. The board has complete confidence in Mr. Cobblepot. As his resume goes into great detail, his endeavors in England have been quite successful. Besides, the company basically runs itself at this point. The CEO is mostly a figurehead. Don't make this harder than it has to be. I refuse to hand my company over to a criminal. Don't do this, Bruce. Oh, don't worry now. I'm going to take good care of this place. I'm afraid we need you to leave the building immediately. We'll have your personal effects sent to you. Yeah, yeah. Congratulations, Bruce. I couldn't be prouder of you. Alfred. Oh, how sweet. Graduation present. Surely we could let him take this along. Is he going to break it? Oh, how predictable. Bruce. Clumsy, clumsy. No wonder you're not being trusted with nice things anymore. I'll call someone in to clean that up. It'll only take a minute. Oh, Bruce and I can handle it. No trouble. Right, Bruce. <laughs> Bruce! I need security in here right now. No, oh, what was that? This is for? a disaster. You've lost your bloody mind. Bruce, stop this. Oh, for heaven's sake, calm down. Get him out of my office. Let's go. I'm so sorry, Mr. Cobblepot. I'll go fetch the medic. That's very kind of you, Regina. 
Thank you. Uh, animation. What the hell? <laughs> Straight Luce, space all the way. Their mind. <laughs> they can't do this to you. This isn't uh, over yet, Lucius. The entrance. I took care of it. We can't let anyone find out what's down there, Bruce. There are ways they could get in. You know that. It's all safe. Don't worry. For how long? Lucius, I need to know there's someone I can trust on the inside. I'm here for you, Bruce. I've always been here for you, not them. If I stay, I'll have to stop working on our side project. That means no new tech, no repairs if you need them. I could keep an eye on things for you. Let you know what they're up to. Feed you what information I can. But I can't risk Cobblepot finding out what I'm up to. Come work for me. It won't be what you have here, but at least we can keep pace on the new bat tech. I'll go and gather what I can from the lab. Thanks, Lucius. We'll take them down anyway, so... Keep that drive safe. I don't really need anybody on inside. Bruce Wayne will speak on the issue at a press event tomorrow morning where we'll learn more about his decision to step down. More on that in a moment. I still can't believe it. Which part? I wish life were easier for you, Bruce. It's just one thing after another. <laughs> At least I have you. I don't know, having it easy sounds a little boring. Perhaps that's why you never take a vacation. With the children of Arkham accessing Wayne Tech, I have to figure out what their next move is. Bring up a searchable network of all possible electronic traffic related to Wayne Enterprises. If the children of Arkham are in our system, all of this is potentially accessible. All of this? Lucius was very thorough. It means that they could have eyes and ears into almost everything in Gotham. Just like Batman. They had access to the GCBD, we know that. It's not much the dots, question actually. Is what else they'd be interested in. It's supposed to be Filter every cell phone. targets based on known camera. children of activity. Any kind of surveillance device. Patients committed to Arkham going back 20 years. A rather extensive list. With my father's signature as the transferring doctor. Security footage. These date back decades. Alfred, the video at the debate. It's real. This is how they found their evidence. Something Hill did gave them access. At least now I know the truth. City Hall, record of Gotham mayors. Hill had been in office for so long it's hard to remember a time when he wasn't mayor. Look at this. Theodore Cobblepot. Deceased two weeks before the election. No, I... Yes. Yes, I know it takes time, but... statement of the century. Considering I've got at least one of my guys in the ER. Yes, just please let me know when it happens. The children of Arkham aren't going to wait on us. I suppose I can understand the truth of that. Harvey has no idea. It's impossible to tell if the children of Arkham have access to this, but if they do, any action he takes against them, they'll see coming. Are you done here, sir? Or something else. Not yet. Not sure if it matters. I've seen enough. What? I have to go oh. warn Harvey. What? 
fuck? I thought that was keep an eye extra on option. And have Lucius uh, look into it as well. We need to find a way to Warren Harvey out. was actually progress. Very good, sir. Whatever. Probably doesn't matter. Casual walk. <laughs> oh, Mr. Wayne. Welcome. You can go on in. I'm back. Yes, that's right. The back time. I'll need a rental in the meantime. Yeah, yeah, just get it done. What? No, 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 no press conference. Just tell them to reschedule. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll talk later. No rest for the wicked. Uh, hey, Harv. Jesus! Don't sneak up on people like that. I wasn't expecting you, Bruce. You scared me right out of my skin. Oh, Harvey. Relax. It's me. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm sorry. It's, I've been really jumpy lately. Nerves. Uh, did anyone follow you? D no. What? Uh, good. No, that's, that's good. Can never be too careful. My mayoral portrait is scheduled for this morning. <laughs> Guess I don't really feel the part right now. I've been looking forward to this my entire career. Thought I'd win in a landslide. Be loved and supported, but this... I don't know, it just all feels different. I feel hated. Like the city's against me. It's like I don't fit. Like I don't deserve it. After all, is it really a win if it's by default? Well, Gotham's last mayor was Hill, so the bar's pretty low. Can't be too hard, right? Yeah, thanks. I guess. God, the mess that Hill left behind. I'm telling you, it's gonna take months to get everything back on track. I can't get the phone to stop ringing. The city's been in an uproar since the- Hold on, Harvey. <clears throat> You're acting weird, Bruce. Is something wrong? Just tell me! Are we being watched? What is going on? The technology at Wayne Enterprise is compromised. The children of Arkham are using our tech to listen in on Gotham. Oh, I knew it. They're already keeping tabs on the GCPD, and I'm pretty sure you're on their list, too. Bastards! They're like cockroaches. I've had this feeling for a while that I'm never alone anymore, that I'm always being watched. The children of Arkham, they, they attacked my car. They are after me, Bruce. They want me dead. They tried at the debate, and they will try again. How am I expected to leave when I've got a target on my back? I'm telling you, it's like they're always there, in the back of my mind. I feel like I am trapped in a nightmare and I can't get out. They don't run this city, Harvey. You do. You have the highest authority in Gotham. You have all the power, not them. I'm not so sure, Bruce. I'm telling you, they've grown too powerful too fast. I don't know if I can do it on my own. You know what I should do? The GCPD is all but useless against these children of Arkham. Batman knows how this city works. He knows you can't be gentle with criminals. You've got to strike fear into their hearts. And maybe break a few bones along the way. But now you get holding it. holding him back. I mean, just think. Imagine what he could do if we let him off the leash. He won't have the GCPD breathing down his neck anymore. He'll be able to really well. make the children of Arkham pay. Hell yeah. Give him the authority to do what he wants. No one to answer to. No ties to the law. I think <laughs> Batman would like that. His authority would be recognized and signed off by this office. Even better. Batman works outside of the law. Is the no. only one getting anything done in this You're city. Aware it starts. Imagine, just imagine if we had an army of vigilantes just like him. It'll be a new Gotham. A better Gotham. We can use the children of Arkham's methods against them. If they want to play dirty, we'll play dirty. Okay, I'll admit, that plan doesn't sound half bad. It'll be simple, easy. Curfews at the dark, checkpoints at every bridge, 24-7 video surveillance. No one blinks in this city without my say-so. Not sorry, even Bruce. Batman's I'm artificial so eyelids. <clears throat> to blink. Carried away there. Uh, Mr. Dent? 
The photographer's ready for you. Thank you, Deborah. I'll be right out. Please, Bruce. Don't tell anyone about this. I feel like I the game you know, thinking well, out loud. Uh, expected all. me to disagree. I didn't mean any of and, uh... It's just the stress of the job kind of gets to me. Your secret's safe with me, Harvey. <sighs> Thanks, Bruce. I owe you. Again. <laughs> again and again. <sighs> See you around, Bruce. I'm concerned, even though I agreed to all of this. An interview with the Children of Arkham's leader. Oh, this shadow. How Mickey managed to score that. <laughs> you will break your eyes. Bruce? Uh, have you seen today's copy of the Gazette? It just arrived a moment ago. It seems Miss Vale has been talking to some very interesting people. People the Batman would like to find. Do you think she would be willing to help you? She may be the only lead we have on the children of Arkham's leader. Perhaps she could be persuaded to reveal her source. Yeah, if she's been able to talk to their leader, then by extension, so can we. You think she'd hand that information over to Bruce Wayne? And I gave her Montoya's name after Falcone was shot. She might be willing Am to I picking a character again? Well, after this interview, I'm sure the police will become suspicious of all of Miss Vale's sources. And if they find out you leaked Montoya's name... True. We need to be careful. I can't afford to waste time with Vicky. Let's offer her a chat with Batman. I feel like... Good mm. idea, sir. Can you scramble Wait, the line? Right away. He decided for me because it was something yeah. I chose before. I saw your story in the Gazette this morning. I want to talk. Who... who is this? Hello? I think you know exactly who this is. Batman. Investigative journalism suits you. <laughs> I, I like to think so. I've been meaning to thank you. What you did at the debate. I'm not sure I would have made it out of there otherwise. But we were fine I'd with say the Esprit Swain. Meet me at sundown. That's weird. Cobblepot Park. Deal. I gave her info. Hmm. Maybe it was inevitable. It's a strange place to meet. Wasn't sure you were gonna show. Gotta admit, part of me thought it was a prank call. Nothing is ever this easy, especially not when you're a reporter. I need some information from you. It's important. <laughs> yeah, figured as much. So, <laughs> Batman, I'll skip the obvious question. The children of Arkham seem to be your latest target. We all know their methods are extreme, but what about their message? Their leader claims that Gotham's elite have been abusing their power, often at the expense of ordinary citizens. For the record, do you think there's any validity to what they're saying? In your opinion. I don't want this conversation recorded. I thought we were here for an interview. Turn it off. Fine. Their message is picking up traction, especially since the interview. I need to know everything they told you. Does no one read anymore? It was a lot of posturing and grandiose monologuing, really. We're going to purge the city of corruption sort of thing. Not great from an investigative standpoint, but the public will eat it up. Part of the job, you know? If that's the only reason you called me, you should really just read it yourself. They aren't trying to hide their motivations. It's all out there. Clear as day. Gotham needs to know how dangerous the children of Arkham really are. You are hiding the truth. Huh. My editor says the physical copies are practically sold out. I'd say the truth is getting out there. It just may not be the side you like. But that's why I'm here. To get the other half I'm missing. Where did you meet? How did they contact you? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna stop you right there. I'm not selling out a source. Not even for Batman. 
The circumstances of that meeting are confidential. Just like this one. I'm sure he wouldn't want me telling everyone how to get a hold of you. The children of Arkham hurt you too. They don't deserve your protection. Hmm. That's not up to me to decide. I have to remain unbiased. Something you should learn to do. What does that mean? I'm talking about Bruce Wayne. I still want to believe he's a good guy too, but... With the information that surfaced, everyone's angry. Everyone wants him to answer for what his family did. Everyone. Except for you. Why haven't you gone after him yet? No way he just slipped under your radar. But so far, no action from you against him. No investigation. I'm not protecting Bruce Wayne. Maybe not. But in this case, doing nothing sure sends a strong statement. Don't think people haven't noticed. <sighs> I'm not stupid. I know you have Again, some connection. Again, from nowhere, absolutely That data drive nowhere. he gave me? That was from you. But you can't ignore the facts. Whether he intended to or not, his family has been stealing from innocent people for years. So, what are you going to do about it? What is Batman doing to protect them from Bruce Wayne? The people want to know. Believe me, I'll make sure Bruce Wayne's debt is repaid. Gotham will be glad to hear it. Thank you. Good luck with the children of Arkham. I'll be sure your message gets out. <gasps> I can make you talk. You're, you're really going to threaten me. If you think I'm upholding our deal now... God, I could lose my job for this, but... Oh, it worked. Here. This is where we met for the interview. Just please, don't tell anyone I gave this to you. So what's Bruce Bruce's deal? Everybody thinks that he's now uh, doing damage somehow, even though his father was a criminal, but everything's dark. Quiet. Uh, it's empty. No sign of the children of Arkham. He himself didn't do anything. They may not have gone far. So weird. They should be there. They'll show eventually. Uh, I don't doubt you. I'll continue monitoring the drone feeds from here. Thanks. Go and have a look around. There's a body here. Likely the work of the children of Arkham. I'm gonna look around, see what they've been up to. Someone's been practicing chemistry. Something spilled here. This is the drug they've been using. Refined. It's the same as the one given to Montoya and Harvey. This solvent increases dermal permeability. Looks like they ran out of the absorbing agent. These barrels match the shrapnel that I found at the docks. They've been referencing the map. Whatever they're building must hinge on it somehow. This depot is pretty centrally located. A detonation device, but it's disabled. They must have intended to hook it up to something. The timer is set for 27 minutes and 13 seconds. From now? The numbers aren't moving. Doesn't seem to be counting down yet. 
This is how they were timing their route. Alfred, what stations are within a 27-minute train ride from this depot? Looking into the transportation database now. Sir, there's just one. Mercy Street Station. It's one of the busiest places in the city. Thousands of people go in and out every hour. He's been dead for a while from the looks of it. One of the children of Arkham. Loyalty doesn't get you much with these people, does it? Seems strange. There's something else. He was shot dead center. Twice. Executed. It outlived his usefulness, I suppose. This man's veins. They look like Montoya's veins after she was drugged, only... They're so much worse. The same drug from the debate. I feared we hadn't seen the last of it. There's no puncture mark here. No entry point for an injection. So, how did it get in his body? Inhaled? It's not a mystery. Uh, what do we even connect though? Laboratory for mixing chemicals and absorbing agents. Stolen chemicals from the docks. Absorbing agent. They're manufacturing the drug so that it can be absorbed through the skin. Traces of both chemicals here. The drug is being modified here. They're changing it. This train car has been modified. How do you mean? Oh, there is a train car here. <laughs> Clearly the holding tank. It's empty. For now. Easy access. The train car was raised to make working beneath it easier. They wanted to get this done fast. Looks like some kind of sprinkler system. Doubtful they're planning to put out fires. The train car is their delivery system. Maximum coverage. Okay, seems like we know what's uh, going to happen. Just going to spray people with this drug. A modified train car is going to be sent to Mercy Street Station. The drug. The children of Arkham must have found a way to weaponize it. With a drug that can absorb into skin, it will affect hundreds of people at once. They're loading the modified drug into the tanks on the train cars, dispersing it through the sprinklers. The timers are set to go off just as it rolls in over the crowds. We are prepared to contain something of that scale. Releasing a drug like that in so populated an area would be devastating. They could infect the entire city if they had enough. Good thing you reduced their supply at the construction site. Thankfully, there wasn't enough of the chemical to mix with the rest of the stockpile of drugs. There's a train coming. Take cover. If I'd known you were going to make me lug this thing myself, I would have worn more comfortable shoes. Just add it to the list of your mistakes. Must be why you didn't come through on your last assignment. Hmm. We're down to our last few barrels since Batman screwed up the transfer. <sighs> we'll have to make do, I guess. Okay, you two, get these mixed, loaded onto the train. 
This way. Their leader is here, with Catwoman. Catwoman? She's got more of that absorbing agent. She must have a good reason for being there. She plays whatever side meets her needs. Currently, her needs seem to be focused on keeping all nine of her lives. We're done here, right? Not yet. No, 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 no. There's no part two of this. I got what you wanted. I'm done. You might as well come out, Batman. I know you're here. No, no way. I did not bring him here. I honored our deal. Oh, I know you did. But now, you're a loose end. Surrender. Unless you'd like to see firsthand what a critical dose looks like. She joined poor Esther Cobblepot. Death might be preferable. Go ahead, do it. Dark Knight. So noble. Thanks for nothing, Bats. <laughs> Train's ready! Go out! Tank is intact, not going to spread. Hang in there, don't pass out on me. Come on, bats. Should have gone after 
Shut up. I'm gonna get you somewhere safe. Just stay with me. Stay here, okay? Looks Just a lot move. worse. There's no 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 wound even. <laughs> Thank you, Selena. Don't thank me yet. <sighs> Shit. You're lucky you were wearing that suit. You know that was stupid, right? <sighs> there was a blood before what? she actually Showing applied up that. that owl. Taking on their leader alone. Repeat after me, Bruce. I am not invincible. And painkillers do not solve the problem. You weren't gonna There's take no them down open on your wound own. there. They would have killed you. Uh... <laughs> You're one to talk. <laughs> I never pick a fight I can't win. <laughs> I don't think you're getting very far with a shoulder like this. Oh, great. You can stay here until morning. Not that I owe you anything. After the debate, I'd say we're even. Selena. It's fine. You can have the couch until morning. Then I'm done owing you favors. Probably best to lie low for now anyway. I don't want the children of Arkham finding this place. I had it handled, you know. With their leader. I had a plan. Really didn't need you swooping in and messing it up. I was there tracking the children of Arkham. I had no idea you'd be there. Must have been quite the surprise. Yeah. Yeah, it was. That was going to be my ticket out of here. One last job to get the goons off my back. So much for that. Thanks again, Bats. There is another way out. We can take them down together. <laughs> Wouldn't that be cute? The dynamic duo fighting crime. <laughs> Being serious. I know. Things have a habit of not working out for me on the duo front. Oh, oh the ugliest bread of cats. <laughs> Wait, is this hey, Sphinx or one. not? I don't think she likes you. <laughs> okay, she really doesn't like you. Yeah, well, you've got most of Gotham behind you on that. Well, not most. Maybe half. Just trying to be optimistic. <coughs> Tch, cut it out. Some kind of weird Siamese type. This really hasn't been your week, has it? <laughs> you think? I lost my company, my reputation, and I find out my father was... Just like everyone else. They've all got something to hide, Bruce. Every last one of them. Even the so-called good guys. There's always something. I'm starting to see that for myself. Even you have your secrets. Those things you hide from the world. And won't let anyone else see. Well, the difference is my secret doesn't hurt anybody. Then you're better than most. You're a good man, Bruce. But good men don't lie with thieves. I know what I am. No noble intentions. Just the thrill of breaking what they say can't be broken. Knowing there's no safe I can't crack. No fortress I can't infiltrate. Proving I can. I'm never really sure if I can trust you. Can't say I blame you for that. 
I've stolen from corrupt jerks like Hill, but I've taken plenty from good people, too. For what? Some shiny new toys in a crappy apartment on the edge of town? The high is nice, but it wears off. Then you look around and see... nothing. So you get back out there. Try and chase that feeling down. But it never amounts to anything, really. It's not the same, but... I know what you mean. After everything we do, everything we're capable of, coming home just feels... Like a disappointment. Right. <laughs> That's all you're getting. I was hoping for something more than that. No. Can <laughs> get out. God damn it. That's not what we agreed. <laughs> What do you want from me? You know what I want. <laughs> Don't touch me. I'll make it up to you. Are we going do for I have to win? do all the work myself? Or are you gonna undo this for me? We shouldn't do this. We, uh, <laughs> we shouldn't be doing this. Oh, we actually. Did. What's wrong? I thought. Uh, never mind. I don't want to complicate things. No strings. I get it. Let me go get you a blanket. And this cat is ugly. At least she's not hissing at you anymore. Hooray for small miracles. Another drink? Got anything stronger than water? What kind of a girl do you think I am? Never run into anyone else who did this, you know? You can't be Batman all the time. So what's a night off look like? What do you do when you take off the mask? Well, according to Alfred, I don't get out enough. You two are close, huh? Must be nice. You don't have anyone like that? I did. But that was a long time ago. To better days ahead. Morning, Alfred. Oh, thank goodness. I was worried. I hadn't heard from you. I didn't know what happened if... if you were... I'm sorry, I didn't mean to worry you, Alfred. Well, I'm just glad you're okay. I always fear the day you don't come home, Bruce. I know, Al. Where are you, anyway? I, uh... I stayed at Selena's last night. There's a lot of oh. cat food around. <laughs> Nothing happened. 
I wonder I if she did. eats it too. While you're there, this the might bowel. be a good opportunity to learn more about Miss Kyle. After all, we really don't know anything about her. See what you can find lying around, if she's trustworthy. Yeah, um, that's a smart idea. I'll see what I can find. At the very least, you can find that grapple gun of yours. Right. That might be harder than you'd think. She doesn't share your love of organization. Yes, well, I'll see you back at home, Bruce. Her cat eats like a queen while she's eating junk. I mean, there's two bowls and one cat. There you are. Uh, I hope she didn't break anything. <sighs> Vacation spots are just marks on her burglary checklist. Looks all right to me. Nothing growing, at least. At least she's got the essentials. Oh, is this going to be Harvey? Harvey? Yep. <laughs> Hey, I, uh, I brought <laughs> breakfast. C can I come in? I don't know if that's such a good idea. Just for a minute. I oh, really need to talk to you. If you want me to go, see. I'll go. But I have to get this out. Oops. Uh oh. <laughs> Bruce? What the. Seriously. What are you doing here? Have a seat, Harvey. No! I don't need to sit down. Bruce, tell me what is going on. I just came by to check on Selena. What, with your pants off? Back off, Harvey. Don't! Don't touch me! I thought I would come here and... <laughs> so stupid! God, I should have known. I should have known that you would do this to me! The funniest thing is nothing me, happened. <laughs> Both of you! Harvey, nothing happened, I promise you. No, you don't have to answer to him. He... He will not be able to protect you. And I don't need him to. Just get out of here, Harvey. What happens when the children of Arkham come for him? You think you won't get caught in the crossfire? They're coming for all of us. He can't stop them. I can handle the children of Arkham. <laughs> of course. Bruce Wayne can do anything. Everything Harvey couldn't. He thinks he's so much better. Those I'm cups sorry. were what empty. What's going on with you? Where's the coffee? Until now, Harvey has been weak. He's been afraid. Always depending on everyone else to save him. Like a child. Just stop it! The it was no, broken already. <laughs> these aren't your friends. <laughs> the they fuck? aren't going to help you. It's happening. Harvey. All right, now you've got two seconds. Or what? Harvey won't be pushed around anymore. No, he's going to make them pay. Everyone who thought they could hurt him and get away with it. Starting with you. Both of you. You're going to pick that up. Who oh, am I? Yes, you are. All right, fine. You want to fight? Let's go. Her good. Jesus, Harvey. Of course, gotta be fair about this. Can't play favorites. They both deserve it, one way or another. Uh, how about we flip for it? This isn't funny. No, no, it really isn't. Selena. 
Looks like you're first. <laughs> but what if I don't fuck? Yeah, always getting in the middle of things. Stay the hell away from me. The call's already been I want to see what's hap going to happen. <laughs> Bruce. No, I don't want to hurt you. This isn't. They turned their backs on you. Harvey, put the knife down. <sighs> Selena! He's gonna hurt someone. You know we can take him out. He's already Have crazy. You lost your mind? No. He's not gonna stop. Harvey! You need to calm down. What are you doing? No going back now. Come on, Harvey, that's enough. Uh, the, the superpowers were still available. Oh, God. Enough. Please. I don't want to be alone, Bruce. Please, not with him. But I can't. Oh God, I can't listen to him. You're not alone. We're right here. Okay. And I am. I am. I am. My fault. Harvey, don't. Bruce, I... I don't think we can help him. Not on our own. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. He's my friend, Selena. I'm not going to abandon him. He needs professional help. Help you can't give it's him. It's okay, Bruce. I'll go. I don't deserve your help. Go off with your tail between your legs. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Harvey! <sighs> So much for this place. I'm not gonna stick around and wait for him to come back. I thought it would be a while before I had to move again. Yeah, you're right. It's not safe to stay here. And I'm not sure I'm gonna find another place with this kind of private access. Ugh. Maybe I'll live on a boat. <laughs> Kidding. Yeah. Uh, that means you too. Might refuel. <laughs> we won't go far. Don't worry. You should come stay with me. Uh, I don't know. There's plenty of space. Alfred could set up a guest room for you. I'll think about it. I mean, now that the damage is done. <laughs> Great. What was that about? I'm supposed to announce my resignation at a press event today. Somehow try to appear happy that Oswald Cobblepot is taking my job. Sounds like an opportunity. How do you mean? They screwed you out of your own company. You have all this information that could bring them down, and they're handing you a live mic. So use it. Don't be their puppet. Maybe you're right. This could be my chance to expose Oswald for who he really is. Well, exactly Let Gotham have... know he's a part of the Children of Arkham. Exactly. You better get going. I've got some packing to do. The offer still stands. Sounding better and better by the minute. What evidence we exactly have? I'm sorry about all this, Bruce. We've... Uh, we've prepared a brief damage control statement to make this easier. After I introduce you, all you'll have to do is read what's on the teleprompter. And then I can take it from there. Got my little coronation speech just waiting. And please, Bruce, 
Try to be on your best behavior. The very best. Wouldn't want to bring any more shame to the Wayne family name. Now would we? I know it's unfair to ask this of you, but please. Right now, your reputation, your entire legacy, depends on your cooperation. Get through today, and I can help you. I can convince the board to bring you back. It might not be CEO, but it will be something. Of course, Regina. Whatever I can do to help. That's good, Bruce. Trust us to sort this all out. Everything will be fine. Bruce, what's your opinion of the Shiner? Regina wanted me to cover it up with makeup. She doesn't think it looks very dignified. But here I think it's a fine display of what the moral high ground looks like. Mr. Cobblepot. All in good fun, honestly. <laughs> a thrown punch is just water under the bridge. Right, Bruce? Boys are just <laughs> being boys again. and all of that. No hurt feelings, I'm sure. Bruce just didn't like losing the office. I don't know, the black eyes will good look for you, Oz. <laughs> really? Yeah. Shows off just how delightfully punchable that face of yours really is. Bruce! It's time. Bruce, I'm going to introduce you and then you're on. Please, stick to the teleprompter. That's probably the funniest line Good morning, so everyone. Far. And thank you for being here. Wayne Enterprises has always taken its role in the community very seriously. Isn't it funny? And we've all How everything I said to you in the park has come true. Me, and take it everything that's yours. And that's not even a punchline. No, dear heart. Not even close. No one's going to follow you around and take pictures now. It'd almost be sad if you were so bloody handsome. You're just a pawn, Oswald. And everyone knows that pawns are meant to be sacrificed. Yeah, perhaps. Not only pawns. At least I get the joy of watching your shocking and surprising descent first. This is just a first step towards making things right. Soon enough, it'll be Cobblepot Industries, Cobblepot Medical, and Cobblepot Tech on tops of buildings, and you, Waynes, will be what you should have been all along. A forgotten footnote. Cobblepot will come to mean the future of Gotham. And Wayne will be a story no one wants to hear. That is not going to happen. Oh, don't be a sore loser, Bruce. It doesn't look nice on you. Oh, I forgot to mention, I did some digging, and you know how old Hill admitted he had your mom and dad killed? I found out why he did it. Oh, yeah. And I'll tell you the story, but only if you say, pretty please. It's quite the page, Turner. I'm sure you're just dying to hear it, aren't you, Bruce? I know you're lying, Oswald. You don't know anything. I wouldn't lie about this, I promise. Story's too good for that. But suit yourself. And now, Bruce Wayne would like to say a few words. Remember, enjoy yourself, Bruce. After all, you never know how much time you really have left. I've been asked here today to lie to you, to regurgitate a script prepared by the company, all to hide the fact that I have been forced out. But I won't do that. I will not lie to save face. One moment, folks. Try that again, and I'll call security. I know what my father did. I know how much he hurt you. But I am nothing like him. His actions are his own. Stop trying to save face. I worry for the future of Wayne Enterprises. The decisions made in the next few days will be critical in shaping what that future will be. Careful, Bruce. Mr. Wayne, 
Are you having trouble reading the teleprompter? <laughs> I never My did that. replacement, Oswald Cobblepot, is a member of the Children of Arkham. They control his every move. Security! Step back, Mr. Wayne. Oh, that was quite a show you put on, Bruce. <clears throat> My apologies, folks. Please forgive me, Mr. Wayne. Everyone. I, for one, completely understand his behavior. Today. Nice After statement. All, he is the press seemed to eat it up. I rather enjoyed it myself. Not that it'll change anything. It I did what I felt was right. So yeah, well, someone has to. Go. I just didn't think it'd be you. It's not an easy thing. Dropped your pen. That's not. <coughs> Whoa. I should know. I'm sure some of you remember the former beauty of Cosmo You feel that? Now That's a drug taking hold of you. And forgotten. Don't fight it. To the terrible How could you? Retribution, Bruce. I think it's time you knew my real name. I am Lady Arkham. And you already know the Penguin. Look at him up there, taking everything that should belong to him. Mocking you, smug, insignificant bastard. He thinks he can get away with it. Because none of them know who he really is. They wouldn't believe you if you told them. And if we could just get one more round of applause for our friend, the man of the hour, Bruce Wayne! Ouch, someone's a little touchy, it seems. It would be so easy to get rid of him. Who else would deliver justice? That's a cliffhanger. Okay. I didn't expect that, and uh, because I thought the character Vicky was the uh, established one. <sighs> Alright. Mm. 60% went for Montoya? Huh, okay. Eight remain civil. Hmm. Nine percent of players choose to maintain a platonic relationship with Selena. Yeah, <laughs> perfect. We remain faithful to the bro. He's still, uh, still been, been angry at us. Um, yeah, I actually should have beat him up. <laughs> All right, uh, I think I can do another one. Um, it's only been one and a half. After his shocking and atrocious display of violence towards Oswald Cobblepot and members of the press, Bruce Wayne has demonstrated a clear lack of mental stability. That is why, regrettably, I made the decision to have my old friend hospitalized in Arkham Asylum. Even with Batman as its protector, Gotham already has enough deranged criminals on its streets. I believe that Gotham's citizens deserve to be safe, that they deserve to be protected. Even if that means I have to do it myself. 
With the children of Arkham out in full force, we need him now more than ever. Where is Batman?